I feel like once in every man's life, we have dreamed of becoming the strongest being on the planet, physically or mentally. And I feel like although we can't all dedicate ourselves to that task because of the trials and tribulations of life, we can definitely adapt the Barky mentality into our daily lives. Yo guys, it's your boy Jay Chain. Welcome to my channel. If you haven't been there before, make sure you hit the bell notification, subscribe. I'm trying to get like the big dog, so show me some love, all right? So I know you guys see the video title and you want to know what the Barky mentality is. Well, let me tell you. So the Barky mentality, yeah, is basically a mindset, yeah, to get the fuck up, you know, from the oppressive natures of life and actually fight back and become the best version of yourself. You know, we can't watch anime like Barky, Dragon Ball Z and anything else that's great and not adopt the mentality that our favourite characters use to develop themselves, right? Or am I bugging? Okay, so why sit there being a lower level version of yourself, right? We can really ascend and be the best version of you. We can't see our main protagonist constantly battling me, yeah? Leveling up, yeah? Trying to improve ourselves and we're at home like some fat slobs, you know? And if that's how you want to be, cool. But apply it to something that you want. If you want that new job, put in the work. If you want some money, put in the work to get that money to ascend to the next level within your role, your job or whatever you might be doing, you know, to then upgrade and level up yourself. Same goes for if you don't like the way you're looking, get your ass in the gym and put in the work. So this is what you call the Barky mentality. And I use his name as more of a reference because within the anime Barky the Grappler, his only goal is to, be, is to defeat his father, Yujiro Hanra, you know. And I feel like he's so dedicated within his draw, he somewhat forgets about the smaller things in life. And I feel like sometimes in life we dwell on the things that are so uncontrollable, we don't actually put in enough effort into the stuff that is controllable, such as the way we look, such as our financial situations, such as, you know, just being better overall within anything you might be doing, even if it's 1%, yeah, that 1% all adds up, it all stacks up and slowly but surely you will become greater than the person that you once was. And I feel like, you know, when we're watching these animes, right, it's fun, it's enjoyable, we're enjoying it. But I do feel like, yeah, there's a lot of hidden meaning conveyed within our animes that we watch, you know. And I feel like we definitely need to adopt those meanings and apply it to our lives. Like, anime is literally communicating to us daily through each episode, you know, with the strife and, like, the stuff that our cast, uh, the characters are going through. So, we need to then apply it to ourselves. How can we improve? How can we better ourselves? Well, firstly... We need to start off by just getting up and doing something. It might be small, it might be large, but we need to do something. Any movement is better than no movement. You know, and sometimes we forget that as people, like let's work on the stuff, like I said, that is controllable, whether it's big or small, you know, whether it's simply just getting up and making your bed each day. It's a task that you apply to yourself. Now, once you keep doing it, you then move into something else that will get bigger. Once you are able to keep doing it, you form repeti rep repetition, you know, and repetition will then breed greatness, you know, such as the gym. You can't expect to go to the gym, right? Get a better, get a better body, lose weight, you know, put on some gains, right? And go only once a week, twice a week, for only two weeks. No, you need to make it a constant routine, four or five times in the gym every week, yeah? And you need to at least apply yourself for a whole year, literally. Like, imagine a time skip within an anime, right? We normally get the time skip. It's, in this case here, yeah, you're going to be doing it. There isn't no time skip. There isn't no easy route. There isn't just no flash step forward. No, you've got to put in this sort of work. So you're going to appreciate yeah, every ounce of energy that you put in once yeah, the results do come. And this is my point when I say you've got to adopt that Bucky mentality. The mentality never to give up. The mentality to always improve yourself. The mentality to go out there and actually fight for your goals, your dreams. You know, whether that be that new job, you know, that dream body, that dream girl. Whatever it may be, adopt the mentality and apply it to yourself and become great. I'm tired of it, guys. You know, I'm tired of people not becoming who they're meant to be, you know. And I feel like this is just a reminder. And like I said, our animes that we watch daily, they communicate it to us constantly. Like how many times did you see Naruto try to make the Rizanga? You know, our characters constantly go through these problems and they develop themselves and they have to meditate. And why shouldn't we do that to ourselves? Why shouldn't we treat ourselves any better? Do you get it? So guys, I feel like we should definitely take on what our anime is conveying to us more than just the meaning, the surface level meaning and actually get deeper, you know, and learn how to apply these things to our daily lives. And then once we do that, we then have some progressive structure which should then help develop us as people. Guys, this is your boy Jalen Chain. This is just another motivational speech I had to give to y'all, you know. If you enjoy this type of video, because it is different, but I use anime to link it and make it relevant to us people, yeah? then definitely subscribe to the channel 
you know, and check out my other videos. I've got a lot of other motivational type of videos like these, you know, and we discuss various topics in terms of like real life and just anime stuff, of course. So guys, show your boys some love. I'm looking out. I'm extremely tired, you know, but I made this video anyway. This is a quick but short one. I just had work and I've come in to do now more work and work on my side hustle. So that just tells you like I'm adopting and applying my own words that I'm actually giving to you lot to actually make these videos and come out and do this. Cause like I said, I'm trying to get the big dog. So show me some love for that. Yeah. Peace.